We are having guests who are coming all the way from Rwanda, Uganda, Tanzania, Zanzibar, as well as South Sudan. Over the next four days, we are going to have quite a busy uh, and quality engagement. The largest part of this event is represented by suppliers who are showcasing not only their talents, but also products which can make sure that the life of the hospitality market within this region is taken to an, uh, the next level. To all the exhibitors here today, I've seen the hard work that you've put in and uh, in order to display your products and services and to have an outstanding uh, stand, uh, you have all done an excellent job. I urge you to continue in the earnest in offering nothing less than the best. This industry, I would say, is just getting better. It means opportunities that are emerging are foregoing and bound to create new panacea for modern growth and development of this industry. Ladies and gentlemen, I wish to finally commend all of you that I'm glad that regional players are together for this common cause to enumerate our goals for a secure and more prosperous East Africa hospitality industry. Many of you may have witnessed the huge strides that the industry has taken in less than a decade to become a very competitive marketplace now ranked amongst the global players. Indeed, ladies and gentlemen, it would be great to involve all the regional players, all the regional governments in this important journey. But we are glad to say that at least we've been told that out of 35 exhibitors who are here today, I think we have players from Rwanda, we also have the players from Uganda, I'm told, and this is very commendable. Ladies and gentlemen, the only way we can grow the hospitality industry, in my view, in this region, is through partnerships across the member states, and part partnerships must be seen to be working beyond the platforms such as this forum and the ideal hospitality expo at large. With those few remarks, I now wish to declare the second ideal hospitality expo officially open. I have learned a lot, um, seen a lot of things to do with decor, cookery, uh, something to do with staff uniforms in the hospitality industry. It was pretty. Basically, by partnering with the Ideal Hospitality, I feel this is a significant platform uh, where the hospitality industry is concerned. This is something which is, um, uh, I embraced it and I think we are going to be together for many years to come. Yeah, we've seen lots of people in and out. Uh, we've uh, managed to target a different category of client to the clientele we normally have. So it was interesting to see a different market. Experience has been um, educative because clients come and they educate you and I've also met, met, uh, met with so many different types of designers and different types of contractors who we've worked with and we are working with at the moment and uh, it's been uh, so 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 good. We have amazing results, we have a lot of people coming, a lot of people inquiring a lot of people interested in being exposed to what the world trades have to offer Africa. We've seen visitors from all over, local, visitors from Rwanda, and um, we're hoping to see more. We can see the response in these two days. The response has been good, and there is potential to grow. We got a new launch of uh, leather folders, leather room trays and all those things. There is new variety of table uh, linen, there is a uh, new variety of uh, buffet wares, it's new innovations for this year. The hospitality market in Africa is 
growing a lot. Yeah. Without growth, you can't be number one. I've really enjoyed everything because I've seen things that I didn't know where to get them. I've also seen something that I've been looking for, bartending and mixology. Yeah. In the hotel industry, we've been looking for that for, for a very long time. And I didn't know that there's actually a school for it. Basically, it's just to um, keep it up and um, keep the work, good work go, um, going. And whenever you're around, we'll make sure we come because you have some good stuff. This event should be annual. We, we see the need for people in hospitality to come together. Networking is a very key thing in people who are in the same industry and also to know what others are doing and we need to network and trade together. The confidence that this market is growing is depicted also with what is happening on the ground. We are so glad that we've been able in 2013 to walk the talk. The number of exhibitors, at least this time we have the food sector represented, commercial kitchen, we, we have the travel and tours being represented in this. So we can see people have started appreciating it. Uh, this year we've worked so closely with the Rwanda Hospitality uh, Association, together with the Uganda hotelier owners and uh, go places. And we've been able to marshal all these hoteliers from East Africa. We have wine cabinet. We have wine preservation machine, both commercial and ideal for home. We want to make it, uh, I mean, make everyone in the hospitality industry aware about our equipment, about how to preserve wine, about how uh, the best way to keep their wines fresh. This rational machine, it's probably rather the heart of Sheffield. This machine is a self-cooking center, which probably many people in, in Africa do, are not aware of. Okay. We are partners with the Rational Germany. This machine can cook, bake, boil, steam, fry. At one go you put all the foods in one tray without exchanging flavor. What a wonderful machine. Being a new thing, because uh, we don't have a school here in Kenya that trains bartenders. We are the first school and it's like a new thing so people have been really really in our tent asking questions and we're mixing, mixing cocktails for them and the outcome is people are learning more about cocktails and we are happy with this. Our preparation this time has been more elaborate than last year. We've put up a whole live fashion show for the exhibition right to show the concept right from the doorman till the landscaping people. Every single department in the hospitality has been covered and we have live exhibition going on of our designs. Being our first time to participate, we are already liking it. So let them also next year have the same thing, but let it be in an open place where more people can be able to come and see what the exhibitors are offering. There need to be more publicity, so more and more players can uh, join this exhibition and get the advantage of being here and we can advise them what is the right, right product to use for them. We see a future that is going to be highly remarkable, considering that the hotels also need to get themselves branded in style. This, in fact, was a display of its kind uh, within the region.
For the first time ever, the East African industry players within the hospitality market are going to have a recognition of excellence. But what we need to do is to partner with you and have agreed already you are most welcome in Kigali, Rwanda. Well, we have a way of doing business and we do it, uh, or rather what we would call the route to market. We have basically our three ways, that is the export channel, we've got the key account channel that is uh, dealing with the key retailers in the region and we have the distribution channel which is still our business, the route to market to distribution partners who now sell to the retailers. As a foreigner coming from China, yeah, it actually is the first time. Even I participate in a lot of shows all over the world, but it's the first time I have this opportunity to be, you know, spacious here. So it's a very, very good uh, experience for me. You play a part together with Ideal Hospitality in making sure that you bring as many people through those halls. I know a lot of you will complain that there were very many students. Those are your future customers. Unless you just want to scavenge and eat other people's business, you need to nurture your own new business. These are students in hospitality, doing hospitality. They will get employed in the next month, year, two years. But imagine who they will remember when the owner of the hotel asks, where can we get a new kitchen? is Sheffield Steel Delivery. We really thank you so much for having participated in this event and we can only anticipate to continue working with you in the next coming years.